Hey everybody, welcome back. I just watched a video on how to prep for the updates for the Sims, Sim Update 16 in Flight Sim 2020, and Sim Update 3 in Flight Sim 2024. It was very complicated, and so I decided I'd do a video on how to do this quickly and easily. If you're not familiar with add-ons linker, this is one way of doing it. I'll show you how to do it without add-ons linker, but if you don't use add-ons linker, and you can use it for 2020 and 2024, it is a phenomenally helpful program that simplifies a lot of things, updating the sim being one of them. Assuming you have add-ons linker, if you come here into add-ons linker, I'll show you 2024 first, click here on the open community folder button, and it's going to open your community folder. Now move up one folder to the parent folder where your community folder is. You want to click into the folder name and rename it and then what I do is I put a underscore character at the beginning of the file name. You can do it however you want, but this is the simplest way. Once you've done that, come over here, create a new folder and name it community. Now we come back here into add-ons linker and if you click on the refresh folder button, you now have an empty community folder. So essentially what we've done is trick the sim into using the empty community folder and we just have our real community folder is sitting there ready to be restored once we're done. So what you would do is you then run Flysim 2024, let it do its update process because you know you want an empty community folder when you do that. Once the sim has updated, close the sim. And when you close the sim, come back here into the parent folder where we've created the fake community folder. Might wanna just double click into it just to be sure. Come back here into the parent folder, delete the community folder, the empty dummy one that we made, your real community folder, take that underscore out from the beginning of the file name, come back here into add-ons linker, click refresh, and voila. That's how you do it in 2024. 2020, same process. Click on the open community folder button. I've got... Uh, my setup is a little bit different I've, in 2020. I don't know why I've got the uh, packages folder. So just put an underscore at the beginning of the file name or the folder name rather. Create a new folder. Community. Back here in add-ons linker, click refresh. It's empty. Run Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. Let it do the update process. Close the sim. Back here into this folder. Delete the dummy community folder. Remove the underscore from the beginning of your actual community folder name. Refresh and done. If you're not familiar with add-ons linker, I'll put, I've done a couple videos on it. I'll put the links in the description so you can see, so you can watch those videos if you want. The other way to do it, if you don't have add-ons linker, just find your community folder. I have mine set to a custom location for each sim but if you're using the standard install locations, I will put those in the description of the video as well. So you can find your packages folder, go through the same process of renaming the community folder, creating a blank empty dummy community folder, update the SIM, close the SIM, delete the fake community folder, rename your other one back to community, and you're done. Very, very simple. If you have any questions, comments, feedback, I'd love to hear from you in the comment section below. And otherwise, hope everybody's doing well, and we'll talk soon.